Parts of downtown Youngstown looked like a parking lot this morning. The cars were filled with people waiting to get an at-home COVID-19 test from the Youngstown City Health District. First News reporter Hannah Erdman begins our coverage tonight. Traffic was snarled throughout downtown due to the high demand for the at-home COVID-19 tests. Thousands of cars lined up to get their hands on an at-home COVID-19 test. The line was long, starting overnight. The first person in line had been waiting since quarter to one. I saw earlier news reports, and it was saying that how hard the tests are to get. And then they're, they're like selling out in the stores, so you can't really get them. And then in New York, I hear there's lines, and they're hard to get. So early bird gets the worm. The health district began giving out the test kits at 7 this morning, an hour before the distribution was supposed to start. Traffic was backed up for miles from the Cavelli Center, all the way up the Market Street Bridge and beyond. Some people waited in that line for a couple hours before getting to the front of the line. It was, uh, we came in on 680 up there, uh, you know, because they said uh, come down Market Street. We was up there about an hour and a half on that ramp. Another problem is all the side streets, everybody's sneaking in. And it's unfortunate because you want to go, but everybody's trying to sneak in and they may not have been waiting as long as you. Drivers on I-680 also saw delays that were caused by the turnout at the Cavelli Center. Despite the delays, though, the health district was able to move the cars along, and by 10 a.m., they were out of tests. In Youngstown, Hannah Erdman, WKBN 27 First News.